Hi, I'm Pat Malarkey. You might know me. I'm friends with English Tarragona, Gareth and Andrew. I also wrote the two Kelsa books. I wanted to tell you how important books are to me. And let me give you a story about how it was they are in my life. When my son was young, during the summer, I would rent a big house on the ocean, the Pacific Ocean, in Oregon, the United States. And we would invite our friends to come and share the week with us. It was a very big house. All that was required was that they brought some extra food. One of the traditions was after we ate dinner every night, we would sit around and listen to someone read a story. Every night, someone else would read a different story. And it was a wonderful tradition. And it might be something for you to consider. It it's, doesn't have to be in a particular language. It can be Catalan, Espanol, English, Francais, any language. But there's something about sharing stories that let your imagination go free. It's a quiet time. And you also feel very close to everyone around you. So tonight, I am going to read Kelsa, the Cathedral Cat, and the Eyes in the Wall. I am the author. Paul Sanchez is the illustrator, and English Tarragona is the publisher. So let's, I, probably many of you know who Kelsot is. I, she was actually a cat that drew my attention in Parta Alta one day when I was walking around the cathedral. And she was up on a high wall and there was all these cats in the church courtyard. But way up high was this orange and white cat. And she was meowing very, very loud. And I got the feeling she wanted me to tell stories about her. So I went back and decided to write a book. And the first one was... Kelsot the Cathedral Cat and the Eyes in the Wall. The Cathedral de Santa Maria de Terragona is in the old part of the city. Cats, birds, and fish live in its courtyard. They play among tumbled stones. They swim in a fountain. They hide among trees and bushes. An orange and white cat named Kelsot watches over them. One night, Roma the cat visited the cathedral and spoke of a mystery. Two bright eyes look out of an old Roman wall. Who or what could it be? Roma said. Kelsot didn't know, so she left to solve the mystery. Kelsot looked around the Plaza del Forum. Two kittens jumped at moonbeams. Augusti sat on a rock watching them. The black and white cat was half hidden in the shadows. Hello, Augusti. Hello, Kelsot. Have you heard of the two bright eyes in a wall, Kelsot said? Yes, but I don't know which wall. 
Maybe Adria knows. Go to the Jewish arches. At night, many animals come out in the old section. Adria lay in front of a small hole, waiting for a mouse. Hello, Adria, she called. The gray tiger-striped cat looked up. Hello, Kelsot. Have you seen two bright eyes in a wall, Kelsot said? No, Muncie, who lives at the museum, might know. Muncie, who was white, walked in the moonlight in front of the museum. Hello, Muncie said. They rubbed against each other and purred. Cats, when they like each other, they rub against each other and they purr. Can you purr? Can you make the sound of a cat that's happy? Have you heard of the two bright eyes in a wall, Kalsot said? Yes, the wall is close by, Muncie said. I'll take you there. And there are the two eyes looking out at the two cats. Even the moon wonders who it is. Hello, who are you? And why are you in the wall, Kelsot called out. An old black cat climbed down from the small black hole. Signor Maggi, are you okay? Kelsot, is that you? Signor Maggi said. What a dandy cat you are now. They rubbed against each other and purred. I remember when you were a little kitten. In those days, I watched over the cathedral. Now you watch over the cats and birds and fish, Senior Maji said. They sat and watched the moonlight dance on the sea. I haven't seen you at the cathedral in a long time, Kelsot said. I am old, like the buildings, Kelsot. I need to stay cool in the day and warm at night. The hole in the wall is my home now. I enjoyed our chat, but it's getting late. I must get some rest, Kelsot, Senior Maji said. The old cat jumped back into his warm home. Come back to visit again someday. I will, and I will tell the other cats to visit too, Kelsot said, as she waved goodbye to Senior Maji. Now, I will go to the cathedral to tell Roma, you are the two eyes in the wall. Books are so much fun to read and so much fun to share. Sitting with friends, reading a book, a story out loud is a lot of fun. I remember my son's favorite book was The Jungle Book. And when the boys had a slumber party, sometimes one of them would read one of the stories in the Jungle Book. It's very popular. Well, that's the end of this story, and I hope you enjoyed it. I look forward to seeing you again, and good reading. <laughs>